house is on the wrong side of the picture, but... Let me see if this fits any of the shots. Uh, there is, there is kind of. Open the window wider. <laughs> Should I go onto the other side of it? No, it's perfect. Welcome back, you wonderful people. My name's Yanni, and it is my dream one day to make a film and get into a film festival. But before that, there's a lot that I need to learn first. And I learn best by just trying things out. So, I've been setting myself these little film challenges every week to uh, improve my composition, my framing, my color grading, my storytelling, everything. And for this week's challenge, I'm going to recreate shots from one of my favorite films, About Time. About Time, if you don't know it, is a rom-com about a guy who discovers that he can time travel. So he uses that ability to improve his love life and cherish moments with his family. It's directed by Richard Curtis, who did Love Actually and Notting Hill and Four Weddings and a Funeral. The cinematographer was John Gulisarian. Gulisarian. I'll put it up here. Yeah, and I, I love how this movie looks. It's it's so beautiful. It's funny, it's heartwarming, and it makes me cry every time. So if you know the format of these videos from my first one, we'll start with some pre-production. So firstly, I looked up some shots uh, from about time on Shot Deck, and I found frames that I think could work uh, this weekend. We're gonna go away with family, so I wanna try and keep this recreation as natural as possible. Uh, so I went and found frames that could work with us, like, you know, going on walks and having dinner together and just hanging out at the lodge that we're going to. Like, I don't have a crazy camera or a crew or lighting or anything, so I'm just gonna use what there is available to me and put my own spin on the shots, because uh, that's that's filmmaking. That's, that's the fun thing. You take inspiration and you make it your own. And then at the end of the weekend, I'm going to uh, come back, gonna review the shots, and then I'm gonna put it together with music and color grading and some B-roll. And then we'll have a bit of a viewing and see if it worked. And fingers crossed, we, we got some good shots. So if you're bored, if you're not interested in how I got any of these shots, which I think is the most fun part of the video, uh, you can just skip ahead. Skip ahead to the, to the end and just see what we came up with. Hopefully you'll stick around and just see how I went about trying to piece this together because it's, uh, it's gonna be a challenge. Right, I'm gonna go pack and get ready, and then we're gonna get out and shoot. So follow along. Strawberry Lodge uh, with Naomi's family for the weekend. And they're so cute. Cause there's no one else like you. Okay, I think we got shot one. I've been I've been distracted. I think it's it's cl it's close enough, I think. Yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to get these shots without like being too <laughs> without directing them too much. I kind of want them to naturally form, and then I can just just kind of keep my eye out for them if they come up. So it's kind of become like a like a scavenger hunt to get these these frames. What do we do today? We went to a coffee shop. I uh, found a lovely little coffee roasters. The vibe was just perfect. The decor was beautiful. The coffee, like they sold the coffee in beautiful little boxes. You know when you just walk in and they just put, there's such an attention to detail in all these little things. We also went to a petting zoo, got niece to a petting zoo. I think all of us had a better time than she did, actually. Then we 
came back, hung out a bit here at the, at the lodge, and then went for a little family walk through the fields. action for this evening is that uh, we're gonna have some dinner and then we're gonna go find a little pub get some pudding I don't know find some sticky toffee pudding maybe a chocolate brownie and some ice cream the shots that I still need to get they haunt me but I will find them I will I will complete this I will complete these shots tomorrow we're having a barbecue and we're gonna be sat outside and it's gonna fit the vibe of some of these some of these pictures perfectly. So you know, maybe I'll panic by the end of the trip and then I'll just frantically have to go and recreate them. We're escaping and we're going to the pub. We're on a hunt, on a mission for pudding. Sticky toffee pudding or a chocolate brownie with some ice cream. There it is. Um, oh, I missed it. Oh, you missed it. Um, yeah, Naomi's back. I tried to do a video on my own last week and failed miserably. And um, no one watched it. Rose in the crown. Yeah, they don't have sticky toffee pudding, which is sad. But we're gonna share a warm chocolate chip sandwich. Got that shot. We're just waiting for our niece to wake up and then we're gonna go explore Rutland Lake and then come back here for a braai, which is a barbecue, but in South Africa we call it a braai. So this is the first day as well that we're not being absolutely blown away by the wind. It's so beautiful. So yeah, like I was saying, the shots like might not be perfect but how I've kind of storyboarded them out to, to create this little weekend snippet, this summary, this little vignette. Like we'll try and get shots that are kind of close to it, as close as possible, that just, that just naturally happen. I just want to be aware, I just want to like notice them. Just got to be on the hunt. It's a scavenger hunt, got to find them. Yeah, I'm going to go watch the Tour de France again. Let me see if this fits any of the shots. There is, there is kind of. Yeah, let, okay, let's turn that. Yes, perfect. Okay, you just stay there. This place. Ah, there's a bug. house is on the wrong side of the picture, but that's where the view is. So maybe I'll just flip it in post. I don't know. If we need to. It's raining but something in your eyes is shining. You see it's time to let go. I see where you go away. Successful barbecue, unsuccessful World Cup final. Unsure how successful um, my shot getting was. I think the ones by the barbecue, that, that worked well. Everyone sat around the table, around the barbecue. House is on the wrong side, but that's okay. 
It's our last evening, so we're just gonna hang out, chill. Tomorrow we'll go for a little pub lunch and then head home. And then I'll see if any of these shots were, were any good. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Morning, we're packing up, we're leaving, we're going home. Um, but I need to get one more shot. This is the shot that I need to get. Uh, whilst everyone's leaving, we're gonna wave them off and say bye everyone, thanks for a weekend. Flowers will be here. I'm just trying to find the right angle for it. Yeah, this can be our interpretation. Uh, stop. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do. It's really cold. Sweet. The sun has disappeared. Uh, we're going home now. Goodbye, lodge. Bye, geese. Bye. 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 <laughs> okay. Right. Let's uh, let's have a look at some of my favourite shots from this challenge and review, like. How, how, how did I do at recreating them? So shot number one, pretty accurate. Probably the easiest to recreate because I just, I set it up in this way. Um, and also where I spent most of Saturday was just on the grass, watching the Tour de France, watching the cricket. Um, so yeah, very easy to recreate. I think it works. And then shot number two is um, by the house. It's not the right way around. The house is on the other side, but the essence is there, like it catches the vibe. Dinner in the garden, barbecue in the garden. Yeah, I, th I think we did all right, are we creating? Next one, not exactly the angle that I wanted, but it happened naturally. Like I, I had to just try and get as far back as I can. Um, like when I saw Naomi's dad sat there. It's not perfect, but it works, I think. And then this one, I think this was my favorite. Like we were just playing in the water with our niece and it lined up so well. Um, they're not sat down, but the fact we managed to go to this lake and <laughs> kind of looks like the sea. Yeah, I, I think it works great. I think it's a nice shot. And then lastly is us waving everyone off. Like I wish we had the house in the background to properly recreate it, but um, yeah, I think it's funny. <laughs> Naomi nailed it. As usual, I'm gonna let the film play out at the end. I'm gonna add some music that fits with the about time vibe um, and also try and color grade it as close to this like dusty blue and pink um, that they have going on in the shots. I'm also gonna add some B-roll just, just for a little bit of cohesion and to try and create a little bit of a story. I'm gonna let the film play out at the end. Please leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you next Wednesday. All right, enjoy. <laughs> But then came part two of Dad's plan. He told me to live every day again, almost exactly the same. The first time with all the tensions and worries that stop us noticing how sweet the world can be. But the second time, notice On the road, I've been away for far too long. But now I'm on my way back home. I hear the west winds calling. My name, they telling me to head your way down your own past your gates. Keep your eyes on the horizon. I was looking to belong when I'd already found my home. Won't be long, I'm there before the setting sun. For you to fall into my arms The place I call my home I was looking to belong when I already found